please click the subscribe button and the notification icon. It will help us a lot. Yeah, I think going along with the lines of what we were talking about, it's understanding your market. Like, I think it's helpful for the artist to really look what is trending, what is happening in the uh, uh, film industry or whatever industry they're working on. I, I really suggest um, reading the newspaper, like getting all kinds of news um, that is related to your field. Like I subscribe to tech uh, stuff as well, as, you know, AR, VR stuff, as well as animation and film and games, because I want to know what's happening um, in the market and what's the trend, what, what productions are happening at the moment, what's going to be happening, what's the lineup in the next few years, you know, uh, what kind of style are they going for? You know, all this stuff is really important and balance that and uh, figure out like where you fit into that spectrum or if you don't right <laughs> and uh, and i think balance between understanding the market but also developing your own voice too because the whole um understanding the market and say you tailor your work to whatever's trendy that can only get you there it'll land it may land you the job but then what about the next project that's different in, in within the same studio so Again, I think it's balancing between understanding market, but also developing your own voice. And that's going to take time. That's going to take several years. So it's better to get better to get started while you're young. Let's figure out what your own voice is. And while you're at it too, it's kind of like, it's very cliche to say, but it's like, enjoy the journey. Because when you're young and, and young artists, you can take a lot of risk. You know, like you can screw up <laughs> and you can make a, like a experimental paintings and weird weird stuff that nobody will ever see and that's great this is just for you for you to figure out what your style is right when you become a kind of mid-tier to senior artist when you make mistakes people see it more and people point it out more <laughs> and so uh, you know enjoy the journey and every step there's a pro and a con aspect to your um, career so while you're a young artist, like make all the mistakes you can make, like make the first, you know, 10,000 mistakes. <laughs> so you get, so you, you will be a master by that time if you make all, all those mistakes um, early in your career.